Guys, it's halfway through 2023. Steve and I are sitting in the office and said, you know what? Let's get out for a nice drink, nice cold beer. It's a beautiful summer afternoon. Let's get out and see the neighborhood. We're sitting here on the beautiful balcony here at the Stadium Club at the Max, and we're thinking to ourselves, this is great, right? We've got this nice big open patio. We've got some short rib egg rolls on the way. I love the Ditka steak, steak sandwich. I'm a huge fan. Steve, tell me a little bit about the menu. No, it's the Cuban Missile. There's two things always here. Cuban Missile, spicy chicken sandwich. You have a Korean spicy chicken sandwich. It's by far my favorite, of course, with ice cold beers. This is fun for the whole family, right? So if your kids have a sporting event or there's something going on, if you're not familiar with the area and you don't know the Max, the McCook Athletic Ex and Exposition, this is really an awesome place, guys. We, we have a, a regulation size soccer field. I believe there's two regulation size basketball courts here. Don't just take our word for it that this is a great place to be, right? Steve, tell us a little bit about what's sold in Brookfield, Lions, McCook, Hodgkins, our surrounding areas here at the Stadium Club these last couple years. That's right. So all around this area, people have been talking about there, there's been a shortage of homes for sale. And that's simply, you know, it, it's, it's harder, but there's still over the last two years, there's still over 500 houses that have sold just in Brookfield, not including the neighboring towns around us. If we add in condos and townhomes on top of that, it's an additional 150. So there's still 650 houses that have sold in the last two years here in the Brookfield area. You may hear some talk in the media that our local market is down. Looking at the data, we have less houses to sell this year than we did last year. So simply put, the market's down because we don't have that same amount of volume. The market's still strong. Looking at Brookfield specifically, June 2022, there were 36 houses for sale of last year in June, right? June this year, 2023, 27 houses for sale. So you may say, okay, not a huge difference. That's only eight houses, but we are talking a difference of, what is that, about 20% or so. When you hear of those people in the neighborhood that are thinking about selling, is it still the time to get top dollar even though the market is down? Absolutely, call us, come join us. We'd love to have a drink or a bite to eat with you over here at the Stadium Club at the Max. Talk a little bit more about what your goals are. Well, folks, we really appreciate you joining us here on this beautiful summer afternoon over on the balcony here at the Stadium Club at the Max. We're going to finish up these beers before they get warm. Special thanks to you for tuning in, joining us, and also a special thanks to Steve and Phil Palmer and all their wonderful staff here at the Stadium Club for putting up with us and doing our filming today. We appreciate you guys. We appreciate them. And we can't wait to see you throughout the community the rest of this summer. Salud. Cheers.